beautiful souls thank you for joining me today for this beautiful dm to df reading i do hope you're all well and that you're staying focused believing and trusting in that deep inner knowing that unexplainable love that is within you so i'm going to be bringing in that beautiful goodies deck um this powerful deck that she created and it's bright orange which is about the sacral chakra and it's about joy happiness <laughs> being creative so let's see what it is that your divine masculine would love to share and express through this reading today and what you need to hear in this moment and this helps you divine feminines understand what is going on within you and we are feeling things and working through things at different times so this is why these messages are important and very special because it helps you understand in this moment of how you could be, you know, what's going on with you. So let's see what your divine masculine would love to share and express. I am proud of you. I'm so proud of you. Hmm. You may not see me in the 3D because I haven't told you, but I am so proud of you. And again, you know this is true when you're proud of yourself, divine feminine, and it feels so good. And you should be proud of yourself. Lots of blue coming through. The sun doesn't si the sun doesn't shine without you. <laughs> So not being with you, um, they miss your sunlight. They laugh for you so very, very much and they're so proud of you. But with without you, the sun doesn't shine. Everything just feels dark and dim and that there's no point to anything. <laughs> and that's the deeper message to this um, is that when you're not with yourself, the sun doesn't shine. Everything does seem gloomy. Um, and both of you in this preparation are learning to, you know, shine without anything outside of you. Um, and we can only shine and experience the sun, the warmth, the love, no matter what's going on outside of us, when we found it within ourselves. But your divine, this is really sweet that your divine masculine is saying, you know, everything seems so dark and dull without you it feels really painful um and everything seems a struggle because i want to be with you and that's because they're not when they're feeling this when they're not with themselves so a little bit of a struggle coming through i'd say for the divine masculine today but they, they want you to know that they're proud of you so and i hope you know and i hope that you understand that channel and what I've just uh, shared, you make me, you, you make my heart melt. Can you see, can you believe that the, the, um, the pictures on the cards are very similar? Hmm. It is blue. So this is Archangel Michael coming through here. And this is about the throat chakra activation as well. There's so much that your divine masculine wants to share. And they're having this throat chakra activation. I'm trying to understand my feelings. Yeah, I'm trying to understand my feelings and take responsibility of my feelings. But you, you make you make my heart melt. I love you so much, and the sun doesn't shine without you. And I crave your touch. I crave to touch you, and I crave you to touch me. And this is getting more and more intense for me. And. The deeper message is that's everything that's come through because you're one energy and this is your true self speaking to you that you you know you are trying to understand you divine feminines you're giving this compassion understanding to yourself giving patience pa practicing patience and when you're being your you know your true self and you're not worried about anybody or anything and you're in this place of joy, <laughs> which is your natural being, state of being, is, you know, you, your heart melts to yourself. You just love yourself. Huh? You, 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 and you're so proud of yourself, who you are. But this is what's going on with your divine masculine. And this is, you know, again, what's going on within you as well, divine feminines at this time. You crave um, to be with you. And 
when you're not with you, it just feels unbearable. As I said, it feels as if everything's dull and dingy. And your touch, you know, you have this special touch as well. Wherever you're going, whatever you're doing, you have this special touch. And everybody actually craves your energy and your touch because you're so gentle and so kind also is what's coming through. But your divine masculine wants to be able to physically touch you. They crave this. And you crave that as well, to be able to touch your divine masculine. Um, but I feel that as if this crave and this energy is different what's coming through today because <clears throat> of everything that's been going on in this preparation of the purification it's not a, a crave of desperation it's, it's coming from this place of passion of purity they just want to get hold of you to be able to touch your hand and to show you how much they love you and how proud they are um, so let's see what else comes through in this reading today. So the dark truths I'm going to use next from beautiful Liz from Guide by Angels. So what else is it the Divine Masculine would love to show and express to the Divine Feminine? What is it you want to share today, Divine Masculines? Nice clear message. That one did the summer salt, so I'm taking that. I'm changing. I don't want to be with anybody else, so I'm releasing myself from karmic ties. Yeah. So if there has been anybody else involved on your journey, where your divine masculine is with somebody else, they're saying they're making the changes. And karmic ties doesn't always mean another physical person to be a divine masculine to be in a relationship. This can be you know, moving away from old thought patterns, cut, you know, cutting those ties, changing things, you know, things that aren't working for them, that, that, that was coming from this place of condition. They're changing that. They've had enough of this. I don't want to be with anybody else. Um, I can't feel this way about anybody else. I want to touch you. I want to share my life with you and... I'm cutting these ties with what no longer serves me, whatever that is in your situation, beautiful soul that's watching. And there is nothing to be afraid of if there is somebody else involved, is what I, that's coming through. There's nothing to be afraid of because I can't feel this way about anybody else. And Divine Feminines, you know, whoever's involved on your journey, on your side or your Divine Masculine, is all part of the journey and it's all part of you coming into union. <laughs> it's all preparation of you coming into union with your um, Divine Masculine or your Divine Feminine. And I miss you. I miss talking to you. That's why sometimes we talk for hours in person or on the phone. I don't want our time together to end, no matter how it seems to you. So if there's times where... You spend hours talking to your divine masculine, you know, on FaceTime or or on just, you know, this, on your phone. Or you've been messaging. They've never they never wanted it to end. They just wanted to just keep talking to you. And they're missing you big time. And, you know, you miss being with you when you're not with you. And it just creates so much upset for you is the deeper message and you know that you're changing i'm excited i'm looking forward to our future i just need to let the past go first please wait for me so they do get a bit panicky at times because they're thinking you know are, are you going to wait for me divine feminine because there is things that i am still releasing these karmic ties things that no longer serve me which is all about the past um i do get frightened of you know losing you and if you're going to wait for me and they're asking you to wait. Um, but they're feeling, they do feel this excitement about this change. Because they know that their future is going to be so bright with you. I'm dreaming. I dream about you holding me close. It feels safe and warm in your arms. And I never want the dream to end. This needs to be my reality. Yeah, they want to be in your arms. You make them feel safe. Huh. Because they know that you're the one person that does love them unconditionally because you're one energy. That's what you both experience when you come into each other's lives. Um, even if you haven't helped, you know, been in your divine masculine zone, it's something that you feel 
and that's what they feel. They know that, that you know, they just feel safe, feel safe with you. Hmm. And they have dreams about this happening and before they go to bed, you know, when they lay down, when they're sleepy, they think about you holding them and they never want that the, the, the dream to actually end. They don't, they don't want that experience at that time to ever end and they want to make it real now. They want to touch you in the physical, in the 3D. They want to bring down what they've been experiencing in the 5D with you into the 3D, into the physical. They're really craving to physically touch you. I feel you. I've been feeling you close to me, especially at night. Can you feel me the way I'm feeling you? So you're feeling each other. You're having these um, sacred experiences that nobody else understands, but they can feel you and they want you to know that they can feel you. And <clears throat> you're, you know, you're, they're, they're special and unique to you. But what's going on and it's happening at night time. And, you know, again, they're thinking about you holding them as well. And they can feel they can feel what it feels like for you to hold them. And it feels so good. <laughs> so thank you so much for joining me today for this beautiful DM to DF reading. It was absolutely wonderful. I do hope it resonates with you and it's, you know, you're feeling peaceful and you're actually smiling. Um, and it's helped you understand you as well, Divine Feminines. And if you would like extra support on your awakening journey, all the information about the services I offer is in the description box down below. And if you haven't subscribed already, don't forget to subscribe, like and share, because it really does help my channel grow. That's if you feel connected to me and you understand me. And I'm sending you so much love, my support, my strength and light. And I love you so very much. See ya.